Alexa, turn on Robo Rock. Starting to clean. Hey Google, start Robo Rock. Got it. Starting the Robo Rock. In this video, I'll connect my new RoboRock Q5 Plus with the RoboRock app, Amazon Echo, and Google Home. This video is not sponsored. I bought this RoboRock Q5 Plus with my own money. The key criteria for my selection was being able to set no-go zones and the self-emptying bin. Now let's get started. Let's start with an unboxing of the Robo Rock Q5 Plus vacuum cleaner. When it got shipped to me, it was in this package where people can clearly see what it is. There is a quick start guide, accessory brush, the base. This is the bag that will go inside the base. Here is the vacuum cleaner itself. The Robo Rock vacuum cleaner power cord. Here's the tall part of the base. We're going to assemble the base of this Robo Rock now. I'm going to turn it upside down. Here's the part that the vacuum cleaner actually lands on. Turn that upside down. The screwdriver is right here. There are several screws I need to assemble. I have screwed in six different screws. Plug it in like this, tie the cable around so that way it is tidy. Plugged it in, lit up right there. See, is there a bag? Okay, there is already a bag in here. Okay, so I don't even need to load the bags. I guess I got an extra bag, excellent. This would connect to right here, I imagine. So let's just put it on, see if anything happens. Oh, there it goes, okay, I pressed something and it kind of is lighting up. So I'm assuming this glowing feature right here. Okay, it played a little song. Okay, now it's charging. I'm assuming I'm gonna have to charge this thing up. And when it finishes charging, we will continue the setup process. And we're back. We allowed our Robo Rock to charge up. It is no longer glowing. And now we are going to go back to the quick start guide and we are going to scan the QR code to get the app for our phone. Let's scan the QR code, get Robo Rock, and I'm gonna hit open, send notifications, hit allow. And now I get to sign up or log in. I'm gonna sign up for an account. Robo Rock would like to find and connect to devices on my local network. Hit allow. Product and service updates. I'm going to hit agree. And then I can scan to connect or search for device. In this video, I have done some research on the internet about how to set up my Robo Rock with the Robo Rock app. And what I have been told is to actually turn off the cellular data. We're going to try that right now. And then we are going to go over to the Robo Rock. And we're going to follow the process of pairing our Robo Rock. I'm going to hit scan to connect and I've got the QR code here. And now I'm going to press and hold the power and dock buttons for three seconds. Resetting Wi-Fi. Until I hear resetting Wi-Fi, I'm going to hit yes, reset Wi-Fi. And then I'm going to select my Wi-Fi and I'm going to hit next. And then I'm going to say, yes, I want to join the Robo Rock network. Connecting to Wi Fi. Stand by. Wi Fi connected. Dustbin installed. Wi Fi is connected. Use now. I'm going to agree to legal information and I'm going to hit OK. I'm going to update the firmware. I'm going to hit auto update. Update now. updating firmware. This may take five to ten minutes. Firmware update is now complete. I am going to remember to turn back on my cellular data. What I want to do is work with my Amazon Echo device. So I'm going to go to Amazon and then I'm going to add a new device. I'm going to hit the plus button in the top right hand corner. What type of device would I like to set up? And I'm going to type in Robo Rock vacuum cleaner. 
Is my vacuum cleaner turned on? Yes, it is. Is it set up with the RoboRock app? I'm going to say yes. Can you control your vacuum cleaner using the RoboRock app? I'm going to say yes. Connect my RoboRock account. I'm going to authorize the RoboRock account and RoboRock has been successfully linked. Look at that. I'm going to hit close and I'm going to say, do I want to uh, grant permissions? I'm going to say yes, save permissions. And it found my vacuum cleaner. Excellent. Next, where is my vacuum cleaner? It is in the living room. Add to group, add it to the living room and it is set up ready to use. And I can say RoboRock Q5 and I can uh, see the device here and I can also hit settings. I am just going to change the RoboRock name. Just change it to RoboRock. Hit return. And now I've edited the name. So let's see if this works. Alexa, turn on RoboRock. Starting to clean. Alexa, turn off RoboRock. Returning to Dell. Now let's try this with Google Home. Open my Google Home app and I'm going to hit devices. I'm going to hit add device. I'm going to hit works with Google Home. Uh, search. I'm going to type in Robo Rock. And there it is. Robo Rock. Let's see if that works. And I'm going to log in. USA. And I'm going to log in with email. And there it is. Uh, my Robo Rock came right up and it is in my living room next. And I'm going to go back to devices it is here. Robo Rock stopped. And oh, if you touch it, it's going to start running. Oh, look at that. Hey, Google, ask Robo Rock to dock. Got it. Docking the Robo Rock. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel for more smart home content.